you ever find yourself craving spaghetti and during that time none of the restaurant are serving it? Or maybe you are so lazy to go out to find the food? Let me help you. In this video, I'm gonna show you totally how to make a creamy spaghetti carbonara. It can save your money instead of buying the dish that are expensive at the restaurant. But do you know what the history of the spaghetti? My friend will tell you. The history of this creamy is the first time was created by the American army in 1944 in Italy. Then it began to spread throughout Rome in 1946. Until now, this dessert has expanded all over the world and become a popular dessert among the society. In real life, this spaghetti can make us full when we are hungry. That is because we can take this food anytime. For example, for breakfast, lunch, also dinner. Next benefit for spaghetti, it is a simple and easy recipe to make. In addition, we can bring it anywhere we want to go. That's all for real life uses and benefits. Pasta is not only delicious, but it can also fill us for a long time. That is because pasta is among the foods that have a high carbohydrate content. That is why it is the main food in Italy. Only two ingredients are used to make pasta. First is flour and second is water. By using these two ingredients, the perfect spaghetti is created. Eggs are also known as a side ingredient to make pasta so that it is more delicious. When it comes to making spaghetti carbonara, I have two suggestions. To begin, do not use olive oil when boiling the spaghetti because it will be wasted when the water is filtered. It's enough to drizzle a little oil over the spaghetti while it's still soft and filtered. In addition, different seafood such as squid and prawn can be substituted for the sausage and chicken breast. Now, we will be moving on how to cook a delicious spaghetti carbonara which is loved by many people around the world. Do you guys know how to cook a delicious spaghetti carbonara? If you know how to make a delicious one, you can make your beloved one happy. A happy tummy means a happy you. Are you ready for our demonstration? Let's go! Creamy spaghetti carbonara. Looks good, looks so delicious. Let's see the tutorial how to make this spaghetti. First and foremost, we have to pour the water into the wok. And then, we have to turn on the stove. When the water starts to boil, we have to put uh, some spaghetti, uh, some olive oil, and some salt. Now, the water has boiled. So, we put the spaghetti. And we put some salt. And also some olive oil. Okay, now we wait until the spaghetti is tender. A few minutes later. Now, the spaghetti start to tender so we can toss it oh, it's hot so be careful while filtering 
Now we have finished boiling our spaghetti. So now let's proceed to Brother Shake to prepare the ingredient. For the ingredient, we need to prepare the garlic and onion. First of all, we need to use the knife to cut the garlic skin. Then we need to cut the skin of onion skin by using a sharp knife. After we finish peel the skin of garlic and onion, we can see the real garlic and onion. This is the garlic and this is the onion without skin. Then we need to cut the garlic and onion with carefully for the true step. You can see me first. Grip the knife, then push and pull, push and pull, push and pull until finish. After that, same goes to the garlic. Push and pull, push and pull. We need to do with carefully because the knife is very sharp and it is dangerous for our finger then to make the salted garlic we need to prepare the olive oil this oil is already hot then we need to put the garlic and onion into this oil then we need to mix, mix them until the color change. Wow. So this is the garlic and onion already finished to make the salted garlic. Next we will make the sauce of the spaghetti from Amen. Then I will show you the preparation of the sausage and the chicken. First, we take the chicken and we cut the chicken into the cube, like this. Now, I have done cut the chicken into the cube. Next, we also cut the sausage and we get the sausage and we cut it. Now, I also done cut the sausage. Now, I have done both of the preparation of the sausage and the chicken breast. The next step is we put the sausage and the chicken breast into the pan. Okay, I will show you how. Alright, then we stir it. Okay, then we continue stir this pan until we see the ingredient turn to the golden brown okay uh, after we look uh, the ingredient into the golden brown we put the black pepper powder into the pan okay like this all right after that we continue stir it until it continue to the golden brown okay i think we have finished it and then we go to the next step that is we must put the important ingredient into this pan by izan shahmi see you at the next video okay now we proceed to mash ingredient and we have to prepare the, the sausage, a knife, and mushrooms, and lastly, a cutting board. Firstly, we have to cut the sausage. Ok, 
Okay, now we put some oil into the wok to fry the sausage. Alright, then we turn on the stove and we wait until the oil hot. Okay, now you can see the oil is getting hot and we can put the sausage into the wok. Yeah, ready? Oh no! Okay, then we can stir it. Okay, when the sausage is about to cook, we can pour the rego sauce into the wok like this, and we we stir it. All right, guys. So we keep stirring, and then we put the enoki mushroom into the mix. Yes, and keep stirring it. Okay, now I have uh, the spaghetti here. We can see that the sauce is ready, so we can put the spaghetti into the mix. And then we stir it. Okay, now the spaghetti is ready, so we can switch off the stove and then we can proceed to the topping for this spaghetti by Nazar. Alright guys, spaghetti almost done. Now we just need to put a few slices of cheese to make the sauce become tasty and creamy. Alright guys, spaghetti already done. Now let's eat. Alright guys, spaghetti already cool. Okay, let's come close up. Alright, this is spaghetti. Alright, you can look. Okay, and this is creamy sauce. Carbonara. Right. Okay, let's serve. Look at this. Look at this creamy sauce, carbonara. Oh, look at this. Now, let's eat this bag of tea. So delicious. This sauce so creamy and so tasty. Oh, let's try it again. Mm. You guys should try this at home and try by your own. So delicious. So easy to do it. Alright. That's all for me. Thank you.